Hello everyone, it's Lock Rules here. How are you all doing? It's another week and another Tuesday and that means build update. This week, three. And I know what you're thinking, it should probably be finished by now. And I completely agree with you. And even in what is probably gonna be our last build update video, including Bree, yeah, it's still not finished. All the blue dots are houses which still need a little bit of work, interior, something done to them. But other than that, there's no more room left to paste houses. So we're probably about 90% finished. It's just a case of going around and doing a few touches up here and there. But apart from the few finer details which are still needed, the village has taken real true shape and Bree's become a really nice village to tour and explore and really immerse yourself into. One thing I've done to add detail is I've actually added a load of player heads all around Bree. Um, I mean, I've tried to add detail, so I've got apples on trees, I had a rodent back there. I'm gonna try and find, oh, here we go, we've got a barnyard owl to put one of the houses. And I'm just gonna go into, um, where have we got player houses? Uh, let's go into the Prancer Pony. Uh, one cool thing that we've added, which is very important. Um, if we go into the bathrooms here, the old John. Oh, there's a troll face. I'm gonna go in here. This is a bit sinister. Oh dear. Since Bree's just about done, that does mean that a download should be coming out shortly, and it means we can work on other projects, such as the Shire. But that's not all. By far, it's not all at all. Um, the main project which we've been working on for quite a few weeks now is Dolgal Door. Now, Dolgador was actually made by a few of the builders on our server. Uh, Adam Rob, uh, Jedi Master, Yano Jack, TNT, and many, many others, which have all helped out to make this quite a cool structure. And then we're all working on it, um, you know, whenever they have the time, on the side to other projects, which we've been working on. And, you know, this is really, really big, and the amount of trees that Dolgador has in the middle of Mirkwood is really kind of lagging me out. So I'm sorry if I have any lag spikes here. Um, but it's difficult to play, so we're just going to jump down and um, what do we have here? Oh, oh, I've lagged a little bit. Okay, I'm back. Okay, that's, that's just some sort of pill. I thought there might have been Sauron or, or someone like that, because about here we would have the eye, uh, I assume. So if we just fly around here, we've got uh, the main tower, or uh, the, well, the main two towers. Um, which are quite cool and all of this is you know it's really really cool to just explore it becomes quite a good cool parkour area if we jump down here we've actually got where Gandalf was put in a cage because it was naughty um, so I'm just gonna just gonna try and explore by foot just gonna jump down and I'm just gonna walk around here jump up to try and explore I apologise for the lag that Mirkwood has caused me in advance. Used to be a way to fix all of these, which is just get rid of all of these trees for, to, to show off the map. But anyway, this is Dolgaldor. I'll try and fly around on, um, even though I've got low FPS, what I'll do is I'll just speed it up on a low fly speed so you can get to see Dogledore in its entirety without my awful lag. Outside of Bree, an important path has been added connecting Bree and Archet, as well as a trusty cart which players can use to transport themselves about. <laughs> anyway, no, I'm not kidding. Um, you, you can't use a cart to transport yourself around, but it looks cool. Having these sort of things make the road seem more alive. Well, unfortunately, that's about it for this week's Tuesday build update. Um, if you weren't aware, me and Tim will be attending this year's Minecon in London 2015. Ooh. <laughs> so thank you very, very much for watching. Hopefully you're tuning for next week when we start work on The Shire. See you in the next video. Bye.